fans have you know blown up as what we have seen through all of this competition, especially when these two nations are on the screen because as he's going into the game with Urbis let's go. Fantastic nations and two fandoms that will not want to lose this game. There's Karaka. Indonesia Sahansa. with red from the re uh, right Indeed, side Sullivan. and Japan with the blue kits from the left side. Indeed, in that fantastic blue strip. Yeah, I would love to get a hold of. Beautiful Here's jerseys. Hovner in towards Ferdinand. Ferdinand is clock. Clock. Patience to Jenna. Jenna. Look at this calmness. Brilliant play Look there. at Caraca. this accuracy. Caraca. Blocked out of it by Machida. In towards uh, Nakamura on that left-hand side. He's got Hatate just inside him. Nakamura still moving forward. It's cleared away, though. Just, it's going to be a real gut punch whoever takes the first goal here as Ito wins it back Hatate looking in the Minamino will try and capture it Sullivan wins it though and Indonesia are on the charge here Sullivan has got Sananta in the middle slightly better start for Indonesia great ball in there it's just clipped away Only as far as Arhan Arhan oh what a Whoa. ball Karaka what a ball what a beautiful piece of vision and Indonesia have completely cracked open that Japanese defence and have took the lead. Ooh, what ooh, a ball! Ooh, 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 ooh. I don't think anybody in the building saw that except Indonesia. They're having a good laugh about it, but there was nothing funny about it. It was super serious. What a ball that is! Well, look at that smiles, man. It went cool through, as you like. It went through the blue sea of players and landed at the feet of Karaka who swept it home for 1-0. And you could feel it. I told you they have this slightly better chance, but I couldn't expect expect that they go for that through pass and that goal. That was sensational, man. Sometimes it is the things that you don't anticipate that will catch you cold. And I don't think anybody anticipated that type of defense-splitting ball. Here's Doan. Though Japan are going to try and answer quickly. Endo takes the foul. But you quite rightly said, you've said it quite a lot. Although some of these, a lot of these teams have players with through passing, I'm not seeing anybody using the play style. We're not seeing anybody utilize that skill. How about Indonesia? Oh, well, they are now. They certainly Do they are. Have? I don't. They even, I don't even think they needed it to execute that. <laughs> as the ball goes into the box, it was a phenomenal ball in. We said it was going to be fireworks. We said it was going to be chaos. What a ball into the box! We will be talking about that one for quite some time clock Karaka the goal scorer back to clock clock with a stunning cross into the box it's cleared back out the other way back to clock still it's passed into Karaka Karaka Sananta Sananta to Suleiman Suleiman to Ferdinand <laughs> looking back to Suleiman uh, so in the first 20 minutes I'm honest I didn't expect that difference in the gameplay I can see the clear dominance from Indonesia of course Japan can change it switch it instantly but right now Indonesia is making the game they are dominating Ferdinand. look at Great that fantastic in. pass Suleiman still there Suleiman goes around the defense and it gets cleared away I would say this it's like Indonesia play as though it's their personality they play with fun they play with happiness and it's almost as though they're just here to just have a good time and if they win great but they will just play their way here's Hatate but above all they are playing with such a precise accurate play this is unreal their passes they always know exactly what they want to do it's nothing random it's nothing by accident it's nothing unintentional all that what they do is planned you can see it in their games you can see their running behaviors they exactly know where him his mate will be but i'm i'm so impressed of the difference of the skill level right now i would go so far to say now that Japan needs to stay cautious not to concede more goals. If so it goes on like Je that... Jenna looks like he's eyeing up you, a pass again here. Suleiman. You can't survive this pressure from Indonesia for 90 minutes. This is impossible. Suleiman. They Sananta. are too clinical. Sananta into the box, headed clear. It's cleared away here and Japan have got to find a little bit of rhythm. Bear in mind... It is only one goal. And the, the next but big mistake away. is Ivan Jenner. Ivan Jenner into a Solomon. Solomon can he score? He's pulled it back. Potential. Oh my God! Oh! Gina! The vision 
to find the back of the net from that angle through the legs of the goalkeeper through the legs of the defender what a finish that is from Indonesia and they go two goals ahead I swear I have goosebumps I swear I have goosebumps what a sensational play that was what, was what a word? sensational game what was that word you said yesterday no. Gila yeah. what a goal that is what a goal and again it's just the chuckle they're just happy they're just like yeah we've, we're tuned it up we're tuned up against one of the fancy nations yeah, it's alright we know who we are Suleiman took it away it's patience it's personality and it's footwork from Indonesia and that is the power almost the like as he said yesterday it's not the player skills that are making these moves it's the players on the sticks that are doing it and it's beautiful to see their, it's their, wonderful their timing is so insane it's their the timing, timing the is position, so the precision. insane it's the precision it's knowing exactly as you quite rightly said where their mate's going to be where is your teammate going to be at all times where is that next icon going to be and there they find it again Jenna it's a little bit of circus football here Clark and well I told you you can't survive this pressure Right in the next situation, they conceded. And I'm telling you, this won't stop here if Japan doesn't find a solution. Yeah. This won't stop here. This 2-0, it, it not, won't end like that. It's not going to stop here. And I will say this much. Evil-eyed on this whole situation will definitely be Vietnam. And what, where their kind of final standing will be Crazy. after this game. Look at this ball. And this is only ball, game ball, one ball, as well, ball, folks. Ball, ball, ball into ball, the box. Ball, ball. This is only game number one here. It's game one of, a, of the two games we're going to see live on stream here. You see Minamino and... This, to to this Doha, was maybe the first away. time that I see the goalkeeper of Indonesia from the edge of the screen. Un unbelievable, and the first half is almost over. Well, I'll just put this in perspective for you. Vietnam do not play again in this group stage. Two before a goal was, has before been ball was kicked... Indonesia were top of this group. Oh my gosh. As Sananta tries That's to make space. play again. Here's Unbelievable. Suleiman, can he find it? Oh! Suleiman stops. He's trying to find footwork. Can this calm dribbling through? in the box of the opponent, man. Suleiman. It's penalty! penalty! Our first penalty kick of the EA Asian Cup. And it was Look well bought. Look at that bought. smile, man. It was well bought. It was well bought there. It was timed. And the almost the almost impatience of Japan gave that away. We're going to see this now. It's... We're going to find out who's taking it, first of all. It's going to be Arhan against the goalkeeper. Arhan goes down the middle for and 3 you go. It's uh, This is unreal. I, 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 I see it from the first 10 minutes. Indonesia is totally dominating this game. Going in front 3-0 in the first half. This is... And I'm still telling you, this it not, won't stop. This is why we don't break predictions, folks, because you just don't know what is going to happen here, especially within eFootball, especially at the eAsian Cup. We are sitting here. Indonesia are three goals up against Japan. After the day one, and we spoke to you know a couple of dignitaries and a couple of people around the venue who may have been like neutral. And every time I spoke to somebody, they were like, yeah, Indonesia's my favorite team. After what we saw, Indonesia's our favourite team. Indonesia, and and, and it was, today? It's probably still going to be that way. They underlined it twice. And I'll tell you, whose team, I'll tell you who they might be the, the, the most favourite team of. Vietnam. I was about to make this point before that third goal was given in, in, the, uh, in the penalty. Vietnam started this game and started this group off three points today with a minus six goal difference. And how about Japan right now? Japan were three points with a zero goal difference before a ball was kicked. Now it's minus three. Now it's minus three. Do your this maps, is, this folks. is ridiculous. There's another half of football here. And this might be the occasion where three without more a ball halves. being kicked. Before, yeah, yeah, it's three more halves. <laughs> it's crazy. Before a, this might be the occasion where we might see a, a movement in a table without a ball being kicked. Because if Vietnam might just be sat there going, come on, please score more. Please score more Indonesia. Yeah, please score yeah. more. Because it will then boost them up to run us up. But it's completely ridiculous to talk about that. Yeah, we know. are talking about Japan. I know, I know. And that's 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 the thing that blows my mind. We're sat here in utter confusion of it's saying, this is Japan. This was one of the teams this is, that we This is the origin said, of this game. I know, I know. This it's unreal. I know. I, I can't. I'm struggling to find the words for it. It's, it's, like, I'm too it's like walking I'm to the UK in the stadium and kick England out of 5-0. I'd say it's insane. Hey, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, said, <laughs> I know what you did there. <laughs> I know what you did there. No, you can't do that. No, you can't. You can't. It's like you can't in, do it's, that. It's it's insane what they're doing here, and it cannot be understated how good this performance is. Even for the <clears> first forty-five minutes, it is absolutely unreal. And as you quite rightly said, we have three other halves of this game on Everyone this live Do you believe that? Unreal. We have this game, this, this is second half. a blessing. And then we're going got. for a second game. I know, I know, it's insane. And we've, had, we've got still another half of this to go. Absolutely incredible. I, I need to save my energy for the for I the know. day. This is crazy. I I, it's, it's it's the exact same thing that happened yesterday. We got into <coughs> into midway through the, the live stream and we came up against games that Indonesia, funny enough, were in. I can't hold myself. Look at this. They're again attacking. Solomon in towards Ferdinand, cleared away. Only as far as Jenna. Cleared away by Minamino. No one. Japan have and, got and can you to see that? No blue, here. no defense, nothing. They they will go for the fourth goal. Oh, it looks like, ah, interesting. Something that's just spotted in my corner of my field. Of yeah, vision. I've seen that too. Substitution. Yeah, for yeah, yeah. Lever is now on the field. Yeah, exactly. So they Lever has now been in. They but, need to change something. But is the damage done? Uh, no. Is that meant psychologically uh, yeah, is yeah, the yeah, damage yeah. done? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. to, to be subbed in as a three, as we'll see. Offside, yes. Offside. Yeah. To be subbed in as a situation where it's three goals down. And you essentially sub in your superstar after saying, Do you know what, you can you can sit down for a bit. I think even Japan now realise that the, the, the issue they're now in, they've now recognised that actually we're in a bit of a problem here because if they concede more, then it's going to make the next game harder. If they concede even more, they can find themselves into conversations of best third-placed playoffs. From Leva's point of view, it's not easy now because he's not warmed up. Exactly. All of all of them three players now on the pitch are warmed up except him. Yep. So absolutely and that's a big factor in it as well. Corbin. And he's got pressure. Yep. They are expecting a lot from him there's because pressure, as you said he's the superstar. There's pressure, there's hot hands, there's every kind of esport kind of explanation you can think of. But he's got all of that to combat, not to mention the fact that there is a three goal deficit staring him in the face. But I can see now that Japan is more in control of They're the a bit game tighter. than compared to the first half. A bit tighter, a bit more compact, and certainly that will work in the short term. But again, if we get a, a kind of a mirror of this game in the second game, it could be real bad problems. He's aware of that. In towards Doan. Doan with the sling cross into the box. Parry clear by the goalkeeper. Goalkeeper? Clear. Indonesian have something yeah. like that? Goalkeeper? No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, was the, yeah, I was going to say they have an 18-yard box. No, it's insane. Yeah. It's, it, it, but it's the pressure. It's how... But I, I dare I say, almost ordinary, they've made Japan look here. Yeah, it's but you, you can now see, point. it's a difference now compared to the first oh, half. Japa, Japan is doing now a better job. Absolutely, but... Is it enough? Away there. We it's will clock. see. We will find that out. Clock to Jenna. Jenna across to Ferdinand. Sananta. Give Suleiman. The pressure of Indonesia is unreal. Look at that. Only two players in their Jenna, own half. This is there. how how... Do you want to overcome that as an opponent? This is so, so hard, man. Giving you no space, surrounding you always by two, three players in your own half. This is such a high pressure, high up the pitch. This is unreal. It's, it's unbelievable what we're seeing here. It really is. Here's a Tate, though. For Japan, get one back here. into the corner, nothing given, just strong enough by Indonesian defensive standards, is Karaka. It's an answer to Clock. Clock has now recovered the ball, looking down the right-hand side to Sandy Walsh. Walsh, Karaka, oh. headed down beautifully, strike on, brilliant goal from oh Indonesia! It's four! Oh my gosh. You see Elga, Elga's Elga is so like, happy, look at this. Like, oh, I'm just chilling, I'm just chilling. Unbelievable finish, and, and again the awareness to I'm head it not down. Even on the pitch, than, man. Rather than flick it backwards, it's the awareness to head it down back exactly. across the other way. You would expect that. Exactly. You wouldn't expect a knockdown. Brilliant piece of play. Expect the unexpected here. Exactly. This is Indonesian's play style. Unreal. It's like the game. Do you know what it's like? It's like the game with the ball and the cups. And you switch around the ball and you're trying to hide the ball. It's literally what they're doing in Indonesia right now. They're just saying, which cup's it under? Ah, it's under the left one. No, it's not. It's the right one. They just keep finding ways to just magic everything 
out of Can you imagine that Japan is now scared of the knockout stage? Yeah. After that performance yesterday, it's this is crazy. This is minus four. It's, it's pressure. Only two goals. The, the issue is as well, and you think about it from a psychological standpoint. Japan and their players come into this game knowing what they needed to do, which is almost the perils of day two. Day two, you know Number what's required. Eight. India, for example, knew they needed three points and Number they were in the top two of their group. Yep. Japan do all they needed to do, and I say as simple Number as this, is Ito comes Number forward. 18. But it's just, I'm making this sound really simple, but we just need to get three points to Indonesia. But having that pressure and knowing what they saw yesterday with Indonesia against Vietnam, it's a completely different pressure. So whether it's a strike, it's Ito who's going to recover it. And you know what? Indonesia will give everything exactly. to kick them out. Exactly, exactly. They it's, are like, we are the number one here. Yeah, it's international, as we said, international bragging rights is what is on the line here. And it's international. Well, they won't go easy on them. Absolutely. They won't. Absolutely. Because Five nil, no problem. I will go for the, the sixth one. Oh, yeah, nice, yeah. nice so locked pass. Gerard, could he get back it five? It's bounced back kindly from Patinama. Look at this calm Patinama, dribbling in the box. Calm. This is Patinama. Picks his spot. Yeah, <laughs> Allah, what is this, bro? What is going on here? It's five again from Indonesia. This, this it was is the unreal. patience. It's what you said. That little bit of dribbling from Patti Dama, just to just. It's to like he's alone cross. on the pitch. It's like he's just. It's like he's got a force field around him. It's like he's just got like the nope. You can't come within two yards of me. And he was close to the oh, five-yard box. Patinama, and it, it could get even worse. It's only seven minutes left here. They could potentially put Japan on the rack here. After, after this one game, after this match, after yesterday, Struik forward to Trout. I will. Ooh, Patinama, Patinama looking back in for the forward. It's I'm clear. really thinking about Corner who ball. could beat them. Hard for me to like find said, anyone here. Like I said, if we want to get a Saudi Arabia Indonesia grand final, give me a one of those every day. And week. we will see Iran today. Yeah, we will we see, will see Iran Republic, today. The Islamic Republic of with Iran the will world be champion Hassan Pajani. But ah, it is not yeah, yet done yeah, here. Yeah. Ball True. In from First time to set the direction at the corner kick. It's a trajectory set indeed, just to disguise what set piece tricks that Five Indonesia have. No. It's, it's I can't. I can't believe that what I see. Unbelievable, and it's not over Do yet. I dream? There's still, there's still time on the clock, and Ramdani standing over the corner Ramdani into the box it's going to go towards the back post it's gathered by Maikawa and I think that's the most work he's done outside of picking the ball out the back of his own net is <laughs> Jenna Crazy. tries to head it down but it's won by Japan can they get one goal just to even put a little bit of doubt in they are Indonesian hungry setup? they are still hungry they want the six man they want the seven they will move on they are hungry and they have lost their manners, but Asano is in here. Can Japan get one back? Japan has they got can. one! And it's important. Every it's goal very, now will be really important. important. Japan have got one back and it puts them at a minus four goal difference. So, again, as it stands, if you are a fan of Vietnam, you are looking for a three goal swing in the final game. And Japan just need them to maybe just get one point, but Indonesia look like coming back down the other way. Dradhan. Drajad. This calm dribbling. Calm dribbling That's control, it. Drajad. Look at this tight and calm dribbling. This is wow. Drajad. Wow, wow, still wow, there. wow. Still going. Speaking out the clock here. Come and catch Drajad. me if you can. He's got the ball in. Is that going to go for a corner? It so is. So much pressure, man. It's an ah. unbelievable amount of pressure. You can even see there that Japan are on all out defense, which means they are asking for every player to have their defensive duties on show here. Indonesia, though, have been all action. Japan has got no time to breathe, whether it's in the back or in the front. It's un unbelievable, unreal. Ball into the box. Will there be a header on? Oh, it's headed down in the box, but <laughs> it will finish five goals to one for Indonesia.